Hello everyone, my name is Jose, aka The Pretend Critic, and thank you for watching my channel or watching this video. So something happened in my life that changed my life. I totaled my car, and it changed me in perspective of my life and also how to budget. So today, I'm going to go ahead and tell you what my plans are to go ahead and do a debt-free journey and also a freedom, financial freedom journey. So please go ahead and uh, hit that subscribe button if you want to know more. And here it is, what my plans are for this coming year to start March 1st, how I'm going to start with my debt-free journey slash debt freedom journey or freedom finance journey or something like that. Here it is. So before I go ahead and tell you what my plans are to go ahead and tackle the path of being free with money and no more bills, go ahead and hit that subscribe button again, please, to support my channel so I can go ahead and, and full disclosure, by the way, I am not a financial guru. I'm not any shape or form a financial wizard. I wouldn't be in this spot if I was. Uh, again, if you want to know what has happened and what changed in my life about my car, I will leave a link down below of that video, an accident that changed my life. So my car did get total. I was paying around $630 a month and then uh, another $100 for the car insurance. So that $700 supposedly was something to free up or cash flow, but it wasn't really $700 was basically I was in the red for $200. Now I'm in the black or I have a cash flow of $250 um, because of my credit cards, because of how much I owe in a lot of my credit cards and how much credit card bills I have. I do have a personal loan. I do also have a medical loan to emergency, a bill that I have been paying off with no interest. And I have a Best Buy card too. That's another credit card and a lot of things. So what is my plan to go ahead and do it? Well, I'm going to go ahead and I did my budget. And that's how I found out that I did have a negative cash flow when I had the car. And now I have a positive cash flow. So that positive cash flow will be saving, going to savings, and going to my debt. As you can see in my title, it's going to have a CC and then dollar figure because that is one of the things that I want to do or budget for is to go ahead and pay off all of my credit cards. And that dollar figure will be like my um, notes or journal that how much I've been paying off every month. My plan is to go ahead and do bi-weekly because I get paid bi-weekly. So every time I get paid, I will go ahead and post a video before or during I get paid. I just wanted to say this because I might need your help and that would be, you know, just to give me uh, accountable for everything that I owe. Full disclosure, I travel three times a month. So that does save me because everything is expense. Um, I travel, my uh, car, everything, food. So literally all I have to do budget wise in terms of food is one week one week and eight days. So basically 15 days, 15 days, I'm at five days, seven, five, five, oh, 13 days, 13, 12 to 13 days that I have to budget in terms of meal and transportation. And how am I gonna do that without a car? Well, I will go ahead and just do Uber uh, that is what my plan is and that is what I want. So what is my method or what do I, I'm looking at? I've done a lot of research. I'm going to do a method that is kind of semi that snowball by Dave Ramsey and semi that avalanche. What I mean is I will go ahead and tackle my highest, highest interest debt, which is my credit card. And that's why I want to focus first. I have three credit cards that I will not focus on because that goes to my work. Uh, like I said, I travel three times a week, uh, three times a month, and that is what I use to revolve in 
but and then gets paid every two weeks so I get reimbursed every two weeks so I don't really have interest in those cards because I pay it off right away and then if you see a number uh, in the title that is my plan to say CC the dollar figure of that one credit card it's not going to be the full full payment I just want to see it visually and make this video accountable uh, so my plan is one pay off my credit card like I said then do a pay yourself first uh, savings I put it uh, I put a dollar figure not a percentage a dollar figure uh, every month or every paycheck to my savings which is going to be consist of emergency fund and to sinking fund the other thing of course saving because I am paying the higher interest rate debts that I have which is credit cards I save on interest rates and so that is my methods for saving the other thing that I'm going to be doing for uh, saving is a kind of a round up or keep your change if you have Bank of America so let's just say I have seven hundred seven hundred one dollar and sixty cents that one dollar sixty cents will go to my savings account and then I will divvy it up right now I already have full disclosure I already have a thousand dollar emergency fund but I still don't feel comfortable with it so I'm gonna keep saving and keep tackling my my debt I do oh, have a 401 and I also have a rollover that I had from my previous job uh, IRA it's not the Roth I'm gonna look at that to uh, convert it to Roth and see how much money or how much it will cost me so I have that too so that is basically what this uh, series is this video that I wanted life happens because of that and has opened up for me um, I also am saving with grocery because I'm doing Instacart uh, Instacart is a an app if you guys have it, um, it for me it's Kroger and so I put it uh, in my computer or in my phone and it I can get groceries delivered basically it is uber or postmates for groceries and it takes about an hour or two and it's kind of fun because it's kind of like a virtual uh, shopping every time they would uh, text you hey we don't have this hey we don't have this and then you would say approve or hey forget it just go back come here uh, so I'm doing that instacart uh, first initial is very good but uh, I will have a full review and how it is set up so I have my budget I have my debt payment plan and I also have uh, my intentions of sinking fund and all that I know it's going back and forth but I just want this to be an introduction of how I'm gonna be debt free and financial uh, be financially free and I rebranded <laughs> kind of my my thing is I've also do uh, gift cards website so anytime that I want to go out I have gift cards as well um, lately I just went to AMC I had a $15 gift card because I uh, did surveys and that is another savings for me the other savings for me um, I am gonna go ahead eat only twice a month uh, twice uh, twice a month <laughs> <laughs> that's gonna really me <laughs> I'm gonna eat twice a day um, big meal and then small meal so that's basically it life does happen and me getting a bad thing happening to me actually opened up and I really want to start this one and kick it off and so if you want to join me in this journey uh, hit that subscribe button hit that like button and share it and if you have anything, if you are also having problems with that, or if you have uh, already solved the problems of paying off those debts, uh, leave a comment down below and tell me what are my plans and if my plans are feasible. Again, I just wanna say I'm not a financial guru. This is just my personal finance and I know what I can do and that's why I'm doing it. I'm also going to still do movie reviews. That's why Jose, aka the pretend critic, I love movies. I'm going to do a, a lot of pop culture, but stay tuned. Again, 
hit that subscribe button and life happens.